waiting to be sentenced to a longer prison term. Good evening, everybody. I'm Brian Mudd. I'm Lauren Motter. A jury in Portales has found the mother and daughter who own Taylor Tots Daycare guilty on all counts against them, including a charge of child abuse resulting in death. KMAX Page Peroso wraps up their trial and has a look at the prison sentences they now face. Sandy and Mary Taylor each face 36 years in prison, 18 years for each count of child abuse. Guilty of count one child abuse resulting in death. That's after a jury of men and women convicted them in court on Tuesday. Juror number nine, is this your verdict? Juror number 10, is this your verdict? Juror number 11, is this your verdict? They went to trial nearly a year and a half after the two daycare owners left two toddlers in the back of a daycare van. Both toddlers needed emergency medical treatment. Only one lived. You heard on those videos, Taylor's constantly saying, we love those kids. We love those kids, <coughs> but do they love them? The prosecution spent nearly two hours speaking to the jury, showing video of Sandy Taylor being questioned by police the afternoon of the incident. And she didn't, I guess she didn't, I really forgot, and I guess she forgot, and those two kids were in there. And the defense calling it a tragic, unintentional mistake. The only answer in this matter is accident. And as I've told you, accidents are not crimes. Eventually, the jury agreeing with the state, finding them both guilty on all counts. Guilty of count one, child abuse resulting in death. New Mexico state law requires the Taylors to serve a minimum of 18 years each. A sentencing date will likely be in the next two months. Paige Peroso came.